but this is a, a pretty high-powered room, so I'm feeling a little intimidated by you all. But it's great to see you here um, on behalf of Audubon Florida and its five chapters in Southwest Florida and the 5,000 members of Audubon uh, here in Southwest Florida. Uh, I welcome you to Audubon's Corkscrew Swamp Sanctuary and the Blair Audubon Center, which is the building here. Really, the best stuff is out in the, in the bushes, but um, you, you already know that. Um, so, and as, as Sean said, I am the staff person. I'm the policy staff person. So, another way to say that, I'm the lobbyist for, uh, for Audubon in Southwest Florida and uh, also for the regional chapter Audubon the Western Everglades. Um, I'm really glad to see you all here to participate. This is a day of sharing, learning, and insight into the intricate natural mechanisms and mysteries of this place. What have recent investigations revealed about the diverse <coughs> ecological processes, landscapes, and life forms that comprise the Corkscrew Swamp watershed? Who wants to know? <laughs> well, land managers, academics, farmers, ranchers, our neighbors, biologists working to recover imperiled nature, conservation organizations, human community builders, also known as developers, <laughs> regulatory agencies, and the elected officials that govern them. I hope, too, that a few of us here are just here because we're curious. I know I see a few friends out here that aren't giving any papers, but I know you guys are curious. So this is a good thing. That's why we're here. Uh, if we're not curious, then we're not going to get the job done. For me, while I'm not a scientist, my work is completely dependent on sound science on which to base good policy advocacy. Yes, there's always a set of wild cards in public policy dealing with politics and economics. Some people try to call that a science. Community priorities and even bias. However, at the end of any day of policy making, there really is only the ecological community of which we are all citizens. So, now, having said that and welcoming, welcoming you, let's hear more about wood storks, bears, snakes, frogs, mink, orchids, fire, methane, and ticking time bombs. So, <laughs> Kathleen Smith is going to uh, be our MC for the rest of the day. So, Kathleen. Thank you, Brad.